<laughs> Any markets that go. <laughs> All right, John Legacy, Elite Base. Gear Horror! Gear Horror! Gear Horror! Uh, I've been trying to get my bass chops together so I can eventually do a project where I play bass, maybe sing. Woo! And I have gone through tons and tons of basses trying to find a sound that really works for me. And I really like a bunch of them. I like the Sadowski stuff and the Warwick stuff and the Sandberg stuff and a ton of stuff. Ernie Ball. It's all really cool stuff. Um, I think I've decided on Zahn as the brand that I'm going to use for a number of reasons. And it didn't start immediately either. I had to go through a bunch of different pickup options and a bunch of different preamp options. But the Zahn stuff, for what I found recording-wise and uh, live, playing live, it's got a consistency to the notes that's just crazy uh it's a graphite neck with like a pheno wood or something i don't know really but it's a composite fingerboard and the end result of that it's just like a really it's an immediate attack on the notes and the sustain on it is crazy and the notes ring no matter where you are on the neck it's it's uh, very consistent in volume so i've been working with with uh, Joe Zahn, and we have gotten this one as the first thing that we've worked on together. And this is their Legacy Elite body style, five string. Um, I don't know what the scale is because that's just the type of guy I am. But I asked for a certain type of wood that I thought would be cool. The Zero Cote is, is really neat because of the, the form on it. It's sort of like a satin finish on it. it gives a really kind of cool look. And each one of the, the those sort of tops have got a really sort of specific grain, but I like that. And then it's got a, a strip of purple heart between, and then I think the body itself is swamp ash with the, the graphite neck, and it's a set neck on this one. And then the, the pheno wood kind of um, fingerboard with the, I forget which what type of tuners those are. Those ones. Hmm. <laughs> I think they're Grover too or something, but... But I just found that the the consistency of this bass is just spe specifically in the mix. No matter what you play, your low end is just like a solid chunk. What is this? Yeah. Again, the sustain on it is just awesome. So basically what I ended up going for in terms of electronics, again, it's just like whatever you're doing, it's just you could go have a body. Right? Spinal tap reference. Hey! Ah, you can go go and have a bite. No, nah, you can still be hearing that one. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Screw you, not sustaining. So when we first got this, it was Bartolini's. And uh, Bartolini's are really cool because they've got that sort of more organic sound and had an Aguilar preamp in there, which is also really cool. But it's just not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for the low end to be like a brick. I want the waveform just to be a solid chunk. I'm not necessarily looking for the electronics to give me much in terms of super dynamic range if I don't want it. I mean, I can turn it down and it can be a lot more sort of like mm -hmm. of a, a passive sort of vibe. But I wanted to get these big old active EMG soap bars in there. And so I sent it back to Zahn and they put in the passive EMGs, which were closer because they were like, if you put in the active ones and have this Bartolini circuit, which we ended up deciding on, then you're going to have two preamps. I'm like, yeah, yeah, that's what I want. So when I first got it back, it was the Bartolini with a passive EMG. And then EMG sent me um, 
the active ones. And now I've got two preamps in here. And the combination of those two preamps and this really big, imposing chunk of sort of Ferrari speed, uh, you know, body performance. Hey, let's stutter that out. It's essentially like driving a base truck into awesome town. Base truck. So when I finally do get into a situation where I'm going to be playing bass, um, I certainly uh, will be using the Zon stuff. We're now working on a Sonus, a little different uh, in terms of body construction, and uh, I'm going to try a, a, a bolt-on as well because I think that's something that ultimately I'm going to want to do. And then we're going to do a, uh, a neck through fretless. And then between those three bases, I think uh, I'm good to go. So yeah. Zone, 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 legacy, elite, suck it. <laughs>